So we're going to be now showing you guys how to get the 3D model and then get it onto the 3D printer right to start printing. Do you want to tell us about that, Fernando? Yeah, so uh, you can find any, any designs, any models uh, on free websites like Thingiverse or Kutz 3D. Download them and just go straight to the slicer, the 3D printer slicer that came inside this pen drive. So Miguel is going to show you guys uh, where is the slicer on the pen drive. Yep. So you have in there EasyWare uh, slicer. You just double double click on them. So that's going to open the slicer. Just drag and drop your file inside the slicer. And you have like a custom uh, set, you know, settings over there. And you have like two two types of settings: a fast, you know, just one click settings, and a custom settings. One, you know, one key settings is basically cl one click and slice into your pen drive. You have a fast, standard, and optimized. If you want something, you know, fast that don't need a lot of details, just click on fast, slice, and save on SD card. That's it. And from the SD card, goes to the printer. Okay, just you have another option that you can also import the file. Uh, you can go on here and then you left click and then you choose the model that you want. In this case, we've already imported it onto the, onto the onto here. So as you can see, and then we do what Fernando has told us. So the next step is uh, what what is it? Okay, the next step when you have your file is sliced on your pen drive, just go to the printer. Okay, well, let's get to the next step. And let's get Fernando to show up as well. Hi. So, on the printer, you just preheat for the filament. So you have the option uh, preheat filament in out. So filament in. So the nozzle will start to heat uh, until reaches like a 200 degrees, and when reach 200 degrees, the filament will start to load. Just make sure the tip of your filament is straight. So with this you avoid like clogs and you know blocks when it's loading the filament. Just insert the filament on the top and wait for the extruder heat. When the extruder you know reaches like 200 degrees, the filament automatically will start to load. And you can take your SD card, insert on the side of the printer just on the side and with this you can let's wait a bit more just to heat up and you can just start to print straight forward from the SD card really easy do you want to just tell us like how do you do it on the on our tiny joystick how do you get the printer to yeah so when the you know when the nozzle reaches 200 degrees and it starts to load the filament, like now, here. You have some filament coming through, right? And then you can... Do you want to just show the, the screen to yeah. the... Let yes, me please. see if I can... Uh, yes, you can there see. There it is. 3D printer ready. Print from SD card. And then select your file. And that's it. Just wait to start to print. Okay, so now we will be seeing how uh, the printer will now start printing. We just have to give it some time to heat up.